2008 with me Kriti. Let's get to the headlines first. NSG begins meeting to decide clean waiver for India. Rahul Bajaj believes Singur will not deter the foreign investors. Several injured in a clash at Orissa relief camp and drunken driving takes 90,000 lives annually in India. Now the news in detail. The 45-member nuclear suppliers group that controls the world's nuclear fuel supply began its deliberation in Vienna today to consider an exemption for India. Some of the NSG members raising voice against India want to bring in conditions that includes even stopping of commerce with India if it conducts a nuclear test in future. Expressing his support for Tata Nano Bajaj Auto Chairman Rahul Bajaj today said that the suspension of work Tata Motors Nano plant in Singur was really unfortunate but it would not deter foreign investors to India on a long term basis. He also said that the West Bengal Chief Minister Buddha Dev Bhattacharya had worked very hard in the last four years to secure investments in his state and a Tata pullout could prove to be a setback for the state. More news on the other side of this break. Welcome back. Several people sustained serious injuries as a mob of women clashed with the police at a relief camp in Orissa, Kandamal district today. The women forcefully entered the relief camp alleging that despite being riot victims, the administration was unconcerned about them because they were Hindus. According to officials, only two people have sustained injuries while unconfirmed sources inform the number is 38. According to a survey conducted by Campaign Against Drunk Driving Movement in India, India records the highest number of fatalities in the world when it comes to road accidents due to drunken driving. Every year nearly 3 lakh road accidents are recorded in India in which around 90,000 deaths occur due to drunken driving. Also, one in every 11 person involved in accidents admits to have been drunk while driving. Well, that's all for now, but do join us tomorrow for our breakfast show. Till then, take care and keep logging our website headlinesindia.com.